101.1 FM, AM 1160, and WCCSradio.com. Our conversation this morning with Jen Villa and with um, Linda Mitchell, brought to you by Marcus and Mack, voted best personal injury law firm in the best of Indiana County contest. Marcus and Mack, a law firm representing injured people. Sorry, Linda, it's just every time I see you, I think I'm going to see you walking across the street from the downside <laughs> Indiana office. I faked you out. I drove up in my Indigo van. <laughs> oh, see? See, how am I supposed to function in in that way? Hey, Family Nature Palooza is coming up, ladies. Isn't that exciting? It is. Yeah. Very excited. Yeah, well, why not? So so give me the details. What's coming up? So it's Saturday, June 1st, which Mm -hmm. is next Saturday. It's at Blue Spruce Park. It's 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. It is free. Everyone is welcome. So it's a day of activities, crafts, games, all sorts of um, things for kids, And we just want a lot of families to come out and join us. And we have food. We have the Kona ice truck. We have Sutton's sweet treats. And we have the 4-H doing some food. Mm -hmm. And, um, Jen, do you want to talk about some of the activities? Sure. Um, We're going to have the Wild World of Animals. They're going to do three presentations throughout the day. Um, We also have Joey's Jackets coming to do presentations on water safety. Um, so she's a local mother who lost her 18-year-old to a drowning. Uh-huh. And so she likes to talk about um, the differences between open water swimming versus a pool and just how essential um, water you know, safety jackets are. Sure. Yeah. Uh, we have a scavenger hunt. Um, there'll be field activities, kites, fishing, lots to choose from. This yeah. is really a, 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 an exciting event. Um, it is. And, and it's very, very popular. It is very, very, very popular. We get lots of families coming out, which is what we want. It's a mm-hmm. great day out in nature. Um, you can bring your bike. Remember to bring your helmet and explore the park that way. Mm-hmm. And just join us for the activities you like. We have Sheriff Fayok is coming with Canine Court. He is a, a fixture at Nature Palooza. We can always yeah. count on Sheriff Fayok to come to our activity. So that's another a fun, fun thing to do. And you're greeted as you come in the park by Lisa Spencer. That's yeah. right. Exactly. <laughs> that's all she wants to do. Uh, yeah. Is talk to everyone and greet everyone. She's yeah. Like, that's my job. Yeah. She, yeah. She, she, is, she, yeah. she really gets fired up for this, doesn't she? Oh, yeah. Man. <laughs> never saw anybody get so excited about that. And she's just, she, I mean, she's right there at the gate. She doesn't even get to go in and see all of the events themselves. <laughs> right. But, but she enjoys it that much. Yeah. Speaking of when you arrive, um, there is a registration form and waiver that needs completed. So to save time, if people want to visit the website at childrensadvisorycommission.org, they can download that form ahead of time, complete mm-hmm. it, and then that way their registration will move faster when they arrive. That's a smart move. Smart move. Yeah. yeah. All right. And anybody can come. That's the exciting thing. About it. Anybody can come. And we have we also have tables. We have lots of tables with children's information and things that folks can pick up for kids. Mm-hmm. coloring sheets, whatever. So we have 18 tables, nine activities. So you'll be busy from 10 to 3 if you yeah. come out with us. We have plenty for everyone to do, something for everyone's interest. Like Jen said, yeah. the animals. We have a Boy Scout slingshot activity. Oh, yeah? So, yeah, yeah. yeah. I've never used a slingshot. I'm going to have to check that out. <laughs> mm-hmm. You'll put someone's eye out. Uh, <laughs> I'll try not to. <laughs> safety goggles included. Jen, tell me about the animals, then, because that, that sounds like a really cool thing. Yeah, so um, Wild World of Animals is coming um, in part with sponsorship from the United Way of Indiana County, and they're going to do shows at 1030, noon, and 2. Mm -hmm. Um, So they bring a variety of animals, uh, talk about them. The kids can probably pet some of them. Um, You know, it'll be at the the main pavilion, and people can just enjoy that show. Get to meet an animal face-to-face. Yes. Yes. Fur to fur. Yes, fur to fur, skin, yeah. skin to fur. However you yeah. want to, however you want to phrase that. Uh, yeah. but, well, uh, right next to them, um, Yellow Creek will be there as well, and they'll have wow. a display of animal pelts um, and you know different things that the kids can feel and check yeah. out. Yeah. And and Lisa will have her puppets, I'm sure. Lisa, <laughs> you, you never know what Lisa's going to bring. She, <laughs> she just <laughs> she pulls something out of that bag of tricks, and you just don't know what it's going to be. Yeah. I'm sure she's preparing something. <laughs> yeah, if there ever was an appropriate name for a park ranger, Lisa Meadows uh, would be would certainly be that. Uh, but Family Nature Palooza is, uh, you know, uh, how many years? For this, this is thing? the 11th year. 11 years. Yes. Yeah, and and we remember how how much Kathy Abby Baker just loved. Yeah. Family Nature Pool. It was her baby, wasn't it? Yeah, it was her baby, and she, she did it for many years and started it. And, you know, we sure, we sure miss her, but we know she had to 
go on to other things. She has grandkids and puppies at home. So. Is she come in next week? I thought I she read She is coming she, in yeah. next week to talk about it. She is. Yeah. Yeah. Well, there you go. I'm going to be on vacation. I'm going to miss. Oh, no. I'm going to miss Abby. Uh, so, uh, yeah, Kathy Abby Baker, uh, she, she just loves this event. Uh, and why not? Uh, it's, it's a lot of fun. It sort of is a kickoff event for yeah. the entire summer. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. The Indiana County Decathlon is a part of this too, right? Yes, they are. So they will be um, having an activity where they have a large Indiana County map, and they're going to talk to the kids about which um, park is closest to where they live. Mm-hmm. And they will also be doing their end-of-year drawings for the decathlon. Uh-huh. Uh, they've got hiking and biking um, and uh, and all kinds of things that they are highlighting about that event as well. So uh, you can, if you've been a Indiana County Decathlon participant, then uh, certainly you'll want to be there for that too. Absolutely. Yeah, they'll be set up in the gazebo. Yeah, yeah. All right, so Family Nature Palooza is coming up. Um, how many for you? How many have you been there, Linda? Oh, my goodness. I think this has to be my fourth or fifth. Uh-huh. Yeah, I think so. Jen, not quite so many? Not quite so many. This will actually be my first one. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's yeah. what I thought. Yeah. That's what I thought. Yeah, I'm really well, excited. We really haven't been introduced to you yet uh, because we've we've not had you on, have we? No. I actually just took this um, position three weeks ago, May yeah. 1st. I, I yeah. thought so. So I'm very excited. I've been in the community and human services a long time. I was at the YMCA mm-hmm. for 14 years, and then I was also at United Way. Um, so, yeah, I'm really excited for the opportunity to work with Everyone on the Children's Advisory Commission. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And, and we're very excited to have her and very lucky. Your first big event. Yeah. Yes. Yes, yeah. yes, yes. And yeah. we, we do have to give a shout out to Renda. Thank you so much. You provided a lot of our prizes for our drawings. So thank you. Thank the YMCA. And as Jen said, thank United Way of Indiana County. But thank you. You guys always step up and, and help out with all kinds of things throughout the community. Yeah, well, we want you to see the animals, too. So <laughs> probably zoo tickets in that packet, right? Uh, there might be. Yeah. You might win some zoo yes. tickets if you come out and join I'm, us. I'm thinking, yeah. Yeah, well, that's a big part of it. Uh, and, and, you know, just the fact that you're out in nature, Blue Spruce yep. Park, and you, Lisa Spencer will tell you it's Indiana County's best park. She just loves it. Yep, it is a great park. park. It, yeah, it really bring is. your bug spray, bring your sunscreen, bring your water. Yeah. 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 A lot of folks just go out there to walk the circumference mm-hmm. uh, i walk my dog out there a lot yeah, yeah. i've yeah. seen a lot of people fishing and yeah yeah the grilling the other day so it's quiet it is yeah. quiet it's quiet it's it's, it's just it's a great place if folks have never been to blue spruce park um it's if you want to put it in your gps it's 1128 blue spruce road in indiana yeah but most folks know where it is yeah yeah, yeah we get out for family nature palooza yeah absolutely come join us very good anything else people need to know I think that's it. Just come on out. We've got food, activities, we've got games, we've mm-hmm. got, you'll take home lots of fun stuff, you know, so just come out and tr- join us. If you've never been, try it out. If you've been before, come on back. Sure, sure. And Jen, the website again for folks who want to fill it out and fill out the registration. Yeah, form Children's ahead. Advisory org. They can find all the info about activities, time, registration form. It's all there. Beautiful. Yeah. Beautiful. Hey, ladies, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you for having us. We appreciate your coming. It is the voice of Indiana County. It's WCCS 101.1 FM, AM 1160, and WCCSradio.com. It's Family Nature Palooza. It is next Saturday, June the 1st. I can't believe it's June already. <laughs> yeah. Gosh. 10 a.m. is uh, when it all gets underway. Of course, you can go a couple of minutes early. Make sure you're all registered and sign up and ready to go with the events right off the bat. It is the voice of Indiana County. It's WCCS 101.1 FM, AM 1160, WCCSradio.com. Now, that's next weekend. This weekend is a big holiday weekend, uh, kicking off today for a lot of folks. AccuWeather says we're partly sunny today, 82, becoming cloudy tonight at 54. Tomorrow, variably cloudy skies, a chance of thunderstorms and 82 degrees again. Cloud sun and 84 on Sunday and on Memorial Day, cloudy, a chance of showers and thunderstorms. They do have a little bit of a sun icon on the uh, on the weather forecast for Monday, so we might see a little bit of that. 78 degrees will be the high for Memorial Day. Right now in downtown Indiana, our temperature this morning is 68 degrees. It's the voice of Indiana County, WCCS 101.1 FM, AM 1160, and WCCS Radio. Dot com. Fox News next at 9 o'clock, and then Josh from our WCCS newsroom. It's Indiana in the morning on WCCS.
Serious claims require a serious law firm. If you've been injured in an accident, Marcus and Mac knows what your case means to you. They had the power and experience to help me. I got more than I thought I'd get. If you've been injured in an accident, call Marcus and Mac on the Hurt Line. Hi, I'm attorney Bob Marcus. And I'm attorney Brian Nitterheiser. For nearly 50 years, we've always put our clients first. And remember, if you've been hurt in an accident, tell them you mean business and call Marcus and Mac. GCES. Hey, it's Clint and Galen here from GCES. Since 2010, we've been helping families prepare for retirement. In 2012, we made Indiana PA our home. It's where we put down roots and grew as part of the community. We're here to make your retirement planning straightforward and easy. If you have questions about your future in retirement, we have answers.